Hey guys, Saki here from Saki Tech, and in today's video, I want to quickly take a look at the dark mode that is currently running on an iPhone 7, but which is available on iOS 11. So if you have iOS 11 on any one of your phones, you're going to be able to use the dark mode. Now, as you can see, I'm in the settings, and instead of seeing the usual white settings, we actually have a black settings mode. So if I go out from the phone, and if I launch the calendar, that's also dark. Even if I go to Safari, that's also dark. So I'm on eBay.com, which usually is white in the background, but the dark mode converts everything over uh, to black wherever it can. And if you go back out and just launch the uh, message application, that's also going to be dark. And as you can see, the keyboard itself is also dark. So a lot of, a lot of the stuff in the phone is going to be completely darkened. So let me just launch the news application just to show you guys. And as you can see, that is dark as well. Now, of course, you have to go in and you have to enable this mode. And what you do is you go into the settings and you go into the general. And then from here, what you want to do is go to accessibility and then go into this option where it says display accommodations. So let's go back in here. And as you can see, uh, you can go into invert colors. In the past, we had an invert color feature that a lot of people have been using, but it doesn't look as good. So let me uh, undo this, and that's the uh, full white. It's going to be a little bit bright, but when you invert colors, this is the classic invert option. This is what you get, and when you do go back out, uh, things do get inverted. They do get darkened, but it simply doesn't look good because this is just a color inversion tactic. Uh, if I go to uh, Safari, as you can see, we have some discoloration here that does not look normal. Uh, with the actual dark mode, these things are addressed and it looks actually better. So let me go back in, disable the classic invert, and let me uh, enable the smart invert. It is called the smart, smart invert. So when you enable that, everything is much more smarter. So look at the difference. So just look at the difference. If I enable this and go back out, it kind of looks ridiculous. But if I go back in and do a smart invert, it looks much better. Everything looks normal and natural, uh, but when you go into the settings, it's actually darkened. And when I go into the apps, they're also dark, and it's absolutely gorgeous. Now, I have a white iPhone, um, and just uh, imagine if you had a black iPhone, and if you enable the dark mode uh, to go, it will look pretty good. Also, I want to let you not know that this is a iOS 11 beta. It's not currently uh, iOS 11 final version, obviously, that's going to be coming up later this year. Uh, so there's going to be some glitches. It's not going to look perfect every, everywhere, and it may misbehave. But just remember, that is because it is iOS 11 beta. Okay, so it's still work in progress with uh, frequent updates from Apple. It's going to get perfected. And finally, when the final version gets released, it's going to look absolutely uh, fantastic. Okay, hopefully they can address everything so we have no glitches, uh, no crazy behavior, none of that stuff. Anyway, guys, thank you for watching this video. Uh, let me know in the comments down below what you think about the dark mode. Does it mean anything to you? Do you like it or you don't care? And, uh, of course, give this video a thumbs up. And uh, make sure to follow me on Twitter and Instagram at Saki Tech Online. Guys, have a fantastic day.